I will make this school woodworking jig to cut absolutely perfect wooden circles. I will use my portable guide with bearings. It helps to keep perfectly vertical the jigsaw blade. Link in the description to watch how I made it. And I simply screw this strip of plywood under the base. So here I have this jigsaw circle cutting jig that is ready to cut a perfect wooden circle. With this pivot pin to cut the first arc, and this pivot pin to cut the final circle. You already know how my trick to cut circles works, link in the description. The first bigger arc takes the jigsaw blade to the beginning of the final circle. Here we can see how the guide with bearings goes around the edge of the board. I install the jigsaw blade I insert the first pivot pin Well, sure you already noticed that I have to cut the corners of this thick oak board This is because the bearings support was going to bump against the corners of the board And now I have to cut carefully with a lot of patience without forcing the jigsaw and letting it rest a couple of seconds from time to time I show a fast forward video, but I can tell you that the total time cutting the wood was around 15 minutes. Here I reached the mark. So I insert the second pivot pin. I take the first pivot pin away. And now I begin to cut the final circle. And while I cut this wooden circle, you have some seconds to subscribe to my channel. So far, it is a nice cut. It is curious the layer of sawdust that remains on the cut surface. Uh, stop, 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 stop! Too much smoke there. Well, there is a very small burning here. Ok, I forced too much the cutting blade. If you pay attention to the blade, some teeth lost the tip. The tips of the teeth are rounded. Well, I install a new cutting blade. And let's keep cutting the wooden circle. Before I continue cutting, I always move back the jigsaw just some millimeters. Here I have almost reached the mark that tells where the cut began and where the cut will finish. 
And here I have this very small step, because I didn't reach the end of the cut yet. Ok, perfect. There is any mark in the beginning and the end of the cut. I love how nice this wooden circle looks. Not only because this oak wood is very nice, but also because I could make a very clean cut. And it is perfectly vertical, without any mark all around the circle. In a coming soon video, I will cut a bevel in the edge all around this wooden circle. Thanks for watching! If you like this woodworking technique, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and to click the bell to get all the notifications when I upload a new video.